Hey guys, it's Coach Nevernak here with another video. I just want to talk about how hard it is being an empath. That's why the narcissists have chosen you because you care, you're a genuine person and you're a very positive person. Um, they usually pick empath because that's what's suitable for them. Now, an empath usually wants to see everyone happy, wants to see everyone smiling, wants to be there for everyone. Um, and sometimes it can be risky being an empath because people can actually mistreat you. People can just not be there for you sometimes because you feel they feel like they can run all over you. You're too nice, you know. You care too much compared to people who are not an empath. Um, basically, try and practice. What I did was when I noticed that I'm an empath, I became a bit more like focused on myself more because i felt like it's not good to be too much of something else like you need balance if you're if you're an empath you might need to just look at how you treat people how much you care sometimes we care too much we care so much we need to just turn it down a little bit that way so people don't walk all over us so that's why the narcissist can get away with things well they can't if you already are aware of them being a narcissist because you already thought about it and you're like okay this is not what i like now me i personally feel that when when i found out like he was a narcissist i was like why 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 would someone want to do that uh that's because that's in there whatever <laughs> that's what they want to do you know it's like you can't change people excuse me i'll be back Hey guys, uh, it's Coach Navanaki here again. Uh, I'm back from to continue from my previous video. Um, so basically, what I want to say about being an empath, you need to really um, look at your behavior, pay attention to your behavior, how you care too much about people, strangers, people, of course, who mean the world to you as well, people who you value. But most importantly, look at your behavior. Pay attention to that because to me, I notice that I care too much. I care about my neighbor. I care about my family. I care about my own family. So I care way too much. You need to shrink it down. I'm not saying that you should change completely who you are. But I want to say that um, when you care too much, that's when people can walk all over you. Like I said before, um, you want to set a healthy boundary. Care enough to uh, care enough uh, to walk away when you know that you're mis being mistreated and not respected or valued. Um, care enough to the point where you know that... Sorry, I'm always like focused like this because I want to get all the information out. <laughs> um, uh, pretty much care enough to understand that it's okay to not care about everyone else. It's okay to choose you. It's okay to be selfish. It's okay, you know. Just remember that. You deserve happiness as much as those people who want to get all the goodness out of you. Um, energy vampires, people who just want to talk to you to come and get steal your good energy. Because you can always make more. You know how to get back, you know. But that's not the point. The point is understanding yourself so that you're able to have a healthy balance, okay? Between caring enough and not overly. Alright, so I'll be back with another video. Thank you.